major. Finger three on fret number three on the A string. Finger two on fret number two on the D string. You then have an open G string. Then finger one on fret one on the B string. And finally an open E string at the bottom. When I put all of those three fingers together, when we get them all together we have a C major chord. G major. Finger three goes on fret number three on your high E string. I then take finger number two and put it on the opposite string, which is your low E, on the same fret number, so number three. Finger number one goes on fret number two on the A string. In between all of those fingers, so in between those three fingers, you have the D, G and B string that you're going to play open, so with no fingers on them. And that's G major. D major. We have your second finger, finger one, finger two here, going on fret number two on the high E string. Next to that, on the B string, you have finger three going on fret number three. Finally, you have finger number one going on the G string. When you include that with an open D string just above that finger, we have D major. We do not play the low E string or the A string next to it, just the bottom four strings. D major. A minor. Finger number one goes on the B string. Finger number three goes on the G string. Fret number two. Finger number two goes on fret number two on the D string. Either side of those fingers you have an open A string and you have a high E string that's open as well. When you put them all together, and there's A minor, E minor. We have fingers two and three going on the second fret on the A string and your third finger going on the second fret on the D string. When you play that, with all of the other strings being played open, so the E string, G string, B string and the high E string all open, it sounds like this. E minor. D minor. We have finger number one on fret number one on the high E string. We then can either use your third finger or your fourth finger on fret number three on the B string. A lot of people use this finger, however, I use that little finger. Find which one you think works best. Finally, I take my second finger and put that on fret number two on the G string. So to go over those notes again, fret one on the high E string, finger number three or four on fret number three on the B string, finger two on fret two on the G string. You will also have an open D string to play with that. And you have D minor. 
We don't play the low E string or the A string for this, it's just the bottom four strings. D minor. Thank you for watching, feel free to like and subscribe to help my channel grow. If you found this video in any way useful, please consider subscribing to my Patreon page or one of my many social feeds, links are in the description.